Alright, let's talk about algebra. Now before I go into the details and algebra and we do pass paper questions, I just want to talk about a general idea how you should approach revision for this topic. By the way, this is one of the largest topics. So I want to just give you an idea of what you should be thinking about how to lay down your foundational block, how to approach this then when you are studying for it. Here are four points you should know about algebra. Four points. One, it is... So the basic part of algebra is tested in question two. But you should know But you should know algebra is basically in everything. Basically, every, nearly every question in the exam will have a, the idea of algebra with symbols or letters replacing numbers or placeholders replacing numbers in it. So algebra is a, it's like a foundational block in mathematics, so there's no escape in algebra. Number three is the most important thing. You need to practice to get good. Now algebra is one of the topics that demands the most practice in mathematics. Watching a few of my tutorial videos will really help, but it's not going to replace the amount of practice that you need to actually become better in algebra if you um, are suffering with algebra. So, and I'm not talking five questions. And I'm not talking 10 questions. You need to do a lot, an insane amount of questions. Also focus on multiple choice questions as well. Because multiple choice questions in algebra can be a little tricky. Practice, 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 practice. And the fourth point is that there are a lot of subtopics. There are a lot of subtopics in algebra. So let's list some of these topics. All right, here we go with the topics. Pay close attention to the green handwriting. Topics, one, words, two, algebra, two. Algebra to words, word equation to algebra, algebra equation to word equation. Three, substitution. Four, distributive law and Associative law, commutative law. Five. Indices. Six. Simplification. Seven. Binary operators. Eight. Expanding and factorizing. Nine. Difference of two squares. Ten. Finding the subject of the formula. 11. Linear equations. We run out of paper. 12. Linear inequalities. 13. Factorizing quadratic equations. 14. Simultaneous equations. 15. Variation, direct, and inverse. So, directly and inversely proportional. Algebra half topics. So here's your job. Look at these topics, figure out which ones you are weak in. Write it in the comments below. And as I do a series of videos on algebra, I'll pick out especially the weak topics so that I can best serve you, the YouTube community. Till next time, pay attention to the S-U-B-S-C-R-I-B-E. Subscribe.